abomination. A homosexual, a lesbian, they're an abomination to God. What rights they got? The only right they got is to go right to hell if they don't repent. He's the beginning of knowledge. The fear of the Most High is the beginning of nothing. Yeah. Um, give me um, Luke 177. Because everybody wants you to be afraid of talking out against homosexuals, okay, to talk about transgender. Why do you think God has Sodom and Gomorrah destroy you all that filth? <coughs> and it's coming back. Our kids don't know about Sodom and Gomorrah. You mean Luke 7? Luke, Luke of 177. Yeah. Read. To give knowledge of salvation unto his people. That's all we come out here to do. And, you, and usually when we talk, we talk like this. Knowledge and wisdom and... Uh, read that again. To no. give knowledge of salvation unto his people. There's no salvation in this. There's no salvation in this. So we come out to give knowledge and salvation, guess what? To our people. That's all we're talking about. So why the white man come in? Why the Palestinian come in? You know why? Because it's got, no, three, um, second Peter's three and three. Get that and I'm done. That why they come in? They come in to keep distracting y'all away because if a black man or a black woman don't like nothing, they like a good show. They like entertainment. So those are entertaining demons out here trying to keep you from your king, trying to keep you from your real salvation because they're in their salvation. That's why they complain. Right. All of this stuff going down. The Arab is rich. The Chinese man is rich. The white man's rich. That's their salvation. Salvation means riches and rulership. It don't mean getting wings and going to heaven. They lied to you in church again. The white man, the Arab, the Japanese, the Chinese, they're in their salvation right now. That's why they don't want to let that stick go. They don't want to let it go. That's why they tell you to go to church, <laughs> go to church on Sunday. Read that. Philippians 3 verse 3. Knowing this first, that they shall go in the last day scoffers. Knowing this first, that they're going to come in the last day scoffers. You know what a scoffer is. Read. Walking after their own lust. Walking after their own lust. This idiot on the ground talking about he like black men. He talking about he Jewish when the Jews are really black. Those are scoffers. Those are scoffers because that's when they make our voice change. We go up to meet that wickedness because I'm talking to you in a classroom. This is a classroom. So we talk this way when we reason together. The devil comes in, it gets out of control. And everybody, everybody wants to say, oh, the Bible is this, the Bible's done away, the Bible, there's no laws. Guess what? How, if you think you're going to heaven, how are you going to get judged? You're going to get judged on what? Your heart? Remember the scripture, Mike, get it real quick, that's my last. The scripture on the heart, that's the quick. Um, our heart is desperately wicked all the time. So if you don't follow the law, so when your pastor tell you to follow the Lord's that don't you don't gotta follow the law statutes and commandments, he's giving you a death sentence. And you pay for that death sentence 